What's up YouTube? In today's video, we're going to be taking a look at a New Balance Custom that I did on a pair of 9060s. So I mention all the time how much I love New Balance collabs and how I think they these creative directors take these simple shoes such as a Grey 990 and they, they take it and they make it so creative and so special. And I really love that and I've always wanted to do that myself. Now I've wanted to do a New Balance Custom for a couple months, probably since the summer. Um, and I just never had the time, and I was also really scared to do it. But recently, I was like, you know what? I'm just going to do it. And I came up with this pair of orange, light blue, and navy pair of 9060s. And I am very proud of them. I spent a couple days trying to figure out what colors I wanted to do this shoe and how I wanted it to look. And I would go on my computer, and I would plan out colorways and different patterns. And I just didn't love any of them. There was no colors that I was, like, proud of. After doing that process, it made me respect these creative directors more than I already do. People like Action Bronson, who made those 990 V6s and that Baklava colorway, it's, I don't know how he came up with that. I mean, I mention that shoe in almost every video. That is my favorite shoe of all time. Uh, my goal was to make a colorway that has never been seen before. I wanted it to make it as unique as possible, but also taking inspiration from a couple things. So the light blue took inspiration from its December, its my birthday month, it's Christmas, it's snowy, it's like an ice blue. So I took a lot of inspiration from the light blue from the winter month of December. And the navy and the orange came from the cover of a song, one of my favorite songs of all time. It's an unreleased Lil Yachty song, and the cover is navy blue with a lot of orange. And that song I use for almost every single YouTube video. It's always the cover song for like an on foot look. When I started listening to that song, that's when I started this channel and it just kind of became like my theme song for this channel. It just has a lot of deep meaning to me, so I figured I'd express that on a pair of sneakers. Doing this process of painting the shoe and dyeing it, it, it was really fun. I've never really done anything like this in, in like creative sense, so I, w I really had no idea what I was doing. So I just I went to the store, I bought some paint brushes, I bought some dye, and there were some hiccups, there were some things that I probably should have done, some things that I sh should not have done. Um, but I had a lot of fun doing it and it just added to the process of it is like I didn't know what I was doing I mean, I didn't watch any videos on how to do it I just woke up one day and got to work I think that adds a little more like meaning to the shoes like it was like my first shoe that I did it was, I was uneducated on the the creativity aspect of it and how to paint I don't paint anything in my life so it was a lot of fun doing that process and learning as I went along. As I was painting the shoe, there was things that I was constantly changing. There was like, oh, I'm going to add navy blue here, or I'm going to add more light blue here. Oh, maybe I want to add a new color. It was like, it was just a free process. I just let my creativity run, and it was an ex exceptional experience. The reason I had so much fun doing this is because this is my true passion. I love New Balance, and I love beautiful, loud colors on these New Balance silhouettes. I mean, that's what I hope to do someday in life is, is to make shoes like this, but I guess we'll have to wait and see. So yeah, I mean, I would probably buy this sneaker um, if it came out. Let me know what you guys think of this shoe, and uh, thanks for watching, and more videos are coming more soon. Expect more consistent videos. Thank you guys for watching, and I hope you have a great day.